Ring announcer there declaring it's going to be an elimination tag team match. Now, this is very interesting because this is going to be three tag teams kind of in one match, but there's only going to be two people in the ring at one point. Of course, last night on uh, Figure Four Radio, King Darkstar claiming that this was his perfect tag team match as he could let everyone else do his bidding in the ring. Of course, he's very confident of winning that tag team championship with, of course, the original Andy Ray. Of course, accompanied by uh, the former. Former women's champion Nightshade not looking impressed tonight. Really does not look happy, does she? She's got a face like she's sucking on lemons. And of course the king... The king surely won't be happy that his, uh, his, uh, his escort to the ring is not carrying the gold. Of course, that's the point he made on uh, the Figure 4 Radio. Again, go to our website, figure4radio.webs.com. Uh, that he wanted all the gold and of course Nightshade had lost the women's title very intrigued by the opponents of course it is the uh, asylum now these guys these guys worry me possibly even more than Steve Ace Andrews these guys clearly unhinged they're not they're not all with it upstairs they're, they certainly aren't all with it you see them at the TAW training they are sat in the corner just writing things down a bit of paper, just doing random things, breaking apart a Rubik's Cube, trying to put it back together and making a doll's house out of it is weird. I mean, you could say there are a few turnbuckles short of a wrestling ring. Of course, the music for the TAW champions. Who, in fact, beat the Asylum at Cage Warfare. To win the TAW Tag Team Championship. Of course, the Loose Connections. One of the fan favourites here, probably my favourite, going into the swing to come back out with the gold. However, Darkstar will try and do his best, along with Andy Ray, to stop that. Whereas uh, I don't think the Asylum really knows what's going on. I don't think they need to, in all honesty. Uh, well, like these three teams here showcasing the strength of the tag team division here in TAW. In the asylum, you've got two guys that you really can't prepare for in the ring. Uh, an unorthodox star, you just never know what they're going to do next. Um, then you've got Dark Rain, you've got the brains of King Darkstar, you've got the power of Andy Rain. It'll be very interesting to uh, find out and see what Nightshade's going to play in this role in this sort of triple threat tag team elimination. Well, of course, she's not going to be in a good mood after her previous match against Mia. I think you can do better. Will she take her frustration out in this match? I certainly think so. Or will she take a ball and go home? Who knows? Because they're going to decide who's uh, going to start this, uh, this match. Of course, live by Lewis Cooper. Always entertaining in the uh, in the ring. Of course, uh, short fuse is uh, called short fuse for a reason. Matt Walker eyeing up Andy Rain. In all honesty, I've got the asylum pretty much getting kicked out straight away. In all honesty, here I think all three teams pretty intimidating for their own reasons. You don't belong in the ring with us. You look at the power of Andy Rain, and that's one guy you wouldn't want to mess with. No, but of course they, they, they kept their eye off, the, oh, sorry, they took their eye off uh, the tag team champions. And of course, as they capitalise, we see uh, Lewis Cooper working down uh, Dan Stark Star in this uh, early stage. Looks like Nightshade is having a few problems on the outside of the ring as well. Andy Rain letting those two girls just fight off. Looks like they've taken their, uh, their troubles back to the locker room. So here we have uh, Live by Lewis Cooper in the ring with King Darkstar. Of course, uh, King Darkstar stated that he, uh, stated on air last night that he, he didn't really want to do any of the uh, any of the dirty work in this match tonight. Although it looks like he might have to. 
He certainly will do, even though uh, he's technically very good in the ring. He can also play dirty within the ring. However, uh, Lewis Cooper and Matt Walker have been together for a very long time. They're very gifted as well. Of course, uh, Lewis Cooper wants uh, tagging with Samsung as a protein pounds. So he's been uh, he's won numerous championships and with with that history behind him. And of course, let's not forget the asylum here on the outside of the ring. I think they've gone to see the uh, the recent Lego movie. Uh, I, th I don't think they know where they are ex exactly. Well, uh, I think Jig Jigsaw's clearly uh, clearly favouring his left leg. Um, he might have pulled something in that opening brawl and uh, head case. He's uh, he, he's made it to one in. That's about it. He looks like he's beat already. Will they be able to inject themselves into this match? Well, you never know with uh, the Asylum, really. Just any of them. You never know. They're going to want... I can predict that they might take themselves in and jump in and get the win. You know, this is how unpredictable the Asylum actually are. Well, yeah, I've got to say, if there's one team you cannot predict in TAW, safe to say it is the Asylum. Lewis Cooper sweeping the legs out of King Darkstar. Getting him a nice inverted surfboard. And of course, Darkstar having no choice to but, to, uh, but to wrestle with the peasants. Ah. Nice pinning predicament there by Live by Lewis Cooper. That's kind of interesting that Asylum haven't actually got onto the sort of turn buckle or the actual mat itself, the apron. Saying that, in this match, as it's an elimination match, they'd really have no reason to inject themselves into the match at this point. Uh, clearly feeling that early brawl. They're certainly going to conserve their energy, wait for uh, the tag team champions called Dark Reign as well to uh, wear each other out. And then this is, I tell you what, they might they might be loosening the, uh, the head, losing a few screws, but this is actually quite clever from the Asylum as Andy Reign has uh, Matt Walker in a headlock. I think in, the, uh, in light of both tag teams uh, in the ring at the moment, you got to say that, uh, that Andy Reign and uh, uh, Matt Walker, they've got to be the two intimidating uh, characters of their respective teams. In Darkstar and, uh, and in Lewis Cooper, you've got the brains, you've got the, uh, you've got the, the players that can, they, they, can, uh, they can think the game through, but uh, when you get someone like Matt Walker and Andy Reign in the ring, the intimidation factor playing in, uh, in both cases there. They can just do something, they will snap, they're, they're not called Loose Connection for no reason. Bar the fact that they can just snap like that and change the game at any possibility and any time. Matt Walker calling for a drop kick, not sure if that's the smartest move against Andy Rain. However, despite telegraphing the move, he still did not see that coming. Headcase now choosing to tag himself into the match, just to the point that Matt Walker looked like he was going to take control. Could that be the wisest move the Asylum could do all night? Sent on splash there by Headcase. Jigsaw tags himself in, second time lucky. Now this is quite interesting because the, the tag teams can just tag themselves in if, uh, if another team member, as a well, not another won. team but another team obviously gets near them they can just tag each other in nice little choke bomb there from the uh, the original Andy Rain a man of few words but uh, I tell you when the action kicks up he's one guy you don't want to be in the ring with Andy Rain oh good god no I'll be quite interested to see if uh, Headcase actually knows what's going on and if uh, obviously we, we see in other member of the Asylum in the ring that does he tag himself in so it's actually the Asylum go head to head. That'd be, that'd be quite interesting. But of course they're going to be holding the grudge against uh, Loose Connection as they were the, the, the team that took their titles away from them. Although as you say I'm pretty sure Headcase still thinks he's at home in an Asylum right now. Does he know where he is? <laughs> or is he not? Oh, leg drop. Jigsaw managing to kick out of that beautifully executed leg drop there. Of course, the king showing off his sideburns. They are fantastic sideburns. Just slapping at the poor peasants. Well, after last night's uh, radio show, pretty sure I saw crusty sideburns trending worldwide on Twitter. That would be the, uh, the peasants of uh, the king's kingdom voicing their, uh, their opinions on, uh, on Twitter. Of course, a big boot there 
from Dark Star on Jigsaw. Headcase taking a uh, forearm for his uh, for his worries. Straight in the head. Well, I get the feeling if there's uh, if there's one place that uh, that they're not weak, it's in the head. <laughs> Pretty sure they've taken enough knocks to the head to uh, uh, to not feel anything. Another beautiful delayed vertical suplex there by the original Andy Rain. Because Jigsaw now her on the mat. Uh, it's got to be quite painful. Is he going to be regretting taking himself into this match? Possibly, but Headcase is trying to get the crowd behind him. Banging on that turnbuckle. Doing his best. And of course, Loose Connection just taking their time on the apron. Just regrouping. Enjoying, watching uh, the pain inflicted. On, well, of course, if you're, uh, if you're Lewis Cooper and Matt Walker right now, you've got to love seeing these two guys beat the hell out of each other. You've got to, haven't you? Because it is an elimination. They, don't, they can just let them work their way out as uh, Darkstar slaps Jigsaw. The more, the more these guys take a beating, the easier their job is going to be effectively moving forward in this exactly. match. And that, that is wise from the loose connection. Now, I don't know when it was decided to make this an elimination match, but you've got to presume that uh, Lewis Cooper and Matt Walker got in the ear of TAW management to, uh, to change this to an elimination match because if, uh, if it's not first fall, means they can still uh, they can still stand the chance as long as they don't get pinned they are still alive in this match and they're still champions they are certainly champions and of course they uh, even Lewis Cooper on the side there cheering on for Jigsaw to get back into this match and uh, cause and inflict pain on the original Andy Rain so you think right now in the uh, in the heads of Loose Connection they'd much rather be facing the Asylum one on one yes certainly certainly because I mean Dark Star and Andy Rain they've been together for quite some time uh, they, they know each other. Uh, well, of course, some time they of course they've other. held gold um, all around the country, so they're clearly uh, clearly a well-seasoned tag team, well-established tag team uh, within the uh, wrestling circuit. I heard there's a rumor that, that Andy Rain is actually the father of, of 15 children. You heard that rumor? I heard a rumor. Yeah, apparently he's the father of uh, of, of anywhere up to 15 kids. Um, I say that just shows uh, wherever this man goes. He leaves his mark. He leaves his mark. It's the best I could come up with. We can cut that out. Of course, the king, uh, obviously, not liking being in the ring with uh, such a peasant that he's got to be in the asylum. Now, is it true? Is it true the asylum have to wear masks because uh, they're, they're, their faces are so ugly they don't want to be seen in public? Uh, they, they can't hack being out of the asylum that they need to or conceal themselves and they feel much safer within their masks uh, no one actually knows what they look like underneath Dark Star taking up Jigsaw here under his shoulders and just dropping it he drops him like third period French Huge backsplash there, reminiscent of the great Ultimate Warrior. Of course, Darkstar getting really angry, and that is Jigsaw wow. and Headcase now. The asylum, the asylum have been taken out of this match. The, for, the former, former tag team champions have been dispatched just like that. But what they forgot about as they're working over the asylum was loose connection as Livewire Lewis Cooper gets into the ring and starts quickly on the king himself, Darkstar. And this is what we're saying, it's a very smart move for them just to stay outside the ring, recoup, get refreshed. Lewis Cooper goes for a splash. Andy Rain coming in to break up that pin. Smart move by the big man. I'm not sure if you can see, but uh, Headcase is still lying motionless on the floor outside after the beating from Dark Rain. Suicide dive by oh, Lovely Walker. suicide dive, what a move. And that fuse has certainly gone. If there's one way to take, take Andy Rain Lewis out Cooper of the match, the that Two, was it. Three. Lewis Cooper grabbing the win for his team. They retain the gold. Retain the gold. The retaining the TAW Tag Team Champion as outside the ring. <laughs> Lewis Cooper pins head case. I'm not sure that one will count. No, but they pinned both teams to retain the title. And Andy Rain clearly still reeling after that suicide dive. He probably wishes he was in the asylum right now as well. 
He's certainly going to uh, need to get his head, uh, head sorted. Need to go to the hospital just to find out what the hell's going on. I uh, think Dark Star's just come round and realised what's happened. going on. Like was, this sucks! Uh, Thank you there. Uh, that, that was in fact a few words, um, in fact two to be precise, from Andy Rain. He's clearly not happy about losing that match. By the looks of it, King Darkstar's just realised what's happened. It's he quite, is not a happy man. It was quite obvious that they just took their time on the asylum, on the peasants, that they forgot about the champions themselves. They took their eye off the gold. You've got to say though, uh, on the behalf of Loose Connection, that was the perfect... Uh, the perfect strategy, divide and conquer the, uh, the tag team of, uh, of Dark Rain. It's exactly what they did and it paid off for them.